Today we will continue to talk about the installation of aluminum composite panels using the dry hanging process. In the last video, we talked about the first two steps of the installation of aluminum composite panels. Today, I will finish talking about the last three steps of the installation of aluminum composite panels. Step 3. Installation of aluminum composite panels. Before installation, Edge lines are joined on the steel skeleton to determine the position of the slit between the panels. The four corners of the slotted and folded aluminum composite panel will be joined together by blind rivets. The panel will be installed from top to bottom using high-strength self-tapping nails to fix the corners around the panel to the steel frame. Step 4. Silicon in the caulking. Use outdoor weatherproof silicon in the same color as the design and insert a foam stick 2 to 4 mm wider than the seam width into the slab before applying silicon. The thickness of the silicon is normally one half of the seam width. At the same time, the surface of the board on both sides of the seam should be protected by paper taps to prevent contamination. After applying silicon, Use a spacious scraper to scrap the silicon seam into a concave surface before the silicon surface cures. The silicon surface should be smooth and round, no wrinkles, etc. The paper tabs should be removed from both sides of the seam immediately after scrapping. Outdoor silicon operations shouldn't be carried out on rainy days. Step 5. Cleaning and Preservation After the wear-proof silicon has cured, Clean the entire aluminum composite panel wall with water or neutral detergents. Detergent does not react with the finishes. Individual CRO solution can be cleaned with organic solvents. Then, installation of aluminum composite panels is completed. This is all about how to install aluminum composite panels. Have you understood all in these two videos?